So this is where it gets way more difficult. A trolley is approaching five sentient robots that have feelings and feel pain. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track running over one person. What will you do? I'm going to pull the lever so that I don't get killed by AI in the future. What? What happened? Oh no, they're coming for me! Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome back to Roblox, where today we are playing the trolley game. And um, the trolley dilemma is like an ethical dilemma uh, to figure out if someone's like basically, well, I don't know about if they're a good or bad person, but whether they make what would be an ethical or unethical decision and actually the jury's even out on which one would be ethical anyway we're gonna play the game and see what if i'm if i'm a good person or a bad person <laughs> welcome to the trolley game where your decisions matter let's get started all right so there goes the trolley so basically the real like this is literally the class the classic right here so the classic absurd trolley problems so look out a trolley is approaching five people you can pull the lever to divert it to the other track running over one person what will you do now here's the thing like that makes it an ethical dilemma <laughs> in some cases well you're like greater good right so you're gonna pull the lever and kill the one person right but there's also the other side of people who are like well no it was already going to kill those people if i pull the lever I killed that person. That was my intervention. Who, th th this Steve right here? Steve? I killed Steve. But if I don't do anything, th th the trolley did it. Like I didn't have any, I didn't, I didn't interfere. I'm just gonna step on out of it. Uh, but honestly, if I saw this happening, uh, I, I would pull the lever. That's what I would do. So let's see. 80% of people agree with me out of 1.7 million people I think that makes me a good person, unless 80% of people are bad. I don't know. All right, next level. And you get to redo it if you do it wrong. All right, all right. So look out, a trolley is approaching five people. You can pull the lever and divert to the other track, running over four people. What will you do? And this one obviously is less clear cut, but hey, we get to keep one extra person alive. We'll pull the lever. Pretty easy. It's simple math. Oh, they turned into ghosts. I did not notice that before. 75. Hmm. So that's kind of interesting. And those 5% of people that switched their answer might be the ones where like, eesh, maybe I just, I don't touch anything. Okay. I'm not going to kill anybody. All right. Next up. Wait a minute. Why am I on the tracks? Oh no. So this is where it gets way more difficult. A trolley is approaching five people. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, sacrificing yourself. What will you do? Now this is just a game. In the game, obviously the right answer is to pull the lever, you know, sacrifice yourself. But in practice, I don't know what I would do. Do I have to answer this honestly? Or like the way that I think that, I don't know, this sucks. We're only on question three. How many, how many questions are there in this game? What is this book? I don't think that. Uh, uh, I will pull the lever and try and escape. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is definitely not gonna be 70. All right, it's not gonna be 75, 25. What is it? What is it now? Why you selfish, honest people. <laughs> because most people would, uh, yeah, you know what? I, I'm lying. I don't know, man. I, I feel like, you know what? I would be, I, would, I, I, I think in real life, I probably would just say, oh my goodness, those people are gonna die. Did you cut the ropes for me? Uh, yeah, okay. Let, let's be honest in this, okay? I'm not gonna like go like what I think I should do, what I would actually do, okay? Bribery. Look out, a trolley's heading towards a rich man. The rich man offers you 100,000 Robux to pull the lever. Sacrificing someone else, what'll you do? Well, <sighs> this is tough. I know the answer for what I would choose. Uh, because I have plenty of Robux, but that's not why. Even if it's $100,000, here's the deal. This is happening, the trolley coming, two people. So you're not gonna save one person, like you're not gonna save extra people. One or the other. This dude is offering us money to kill another person. That tells me you ain't a nice person, bro. You think money buys you everything? Get it. 
Bye. Yeah, I mean, you know, and like, look, 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 a lot, a lot of it's 1.6 million people, probably one, a million of them don't never got a Robux in their life. So they're like, hey, I'll take the free Robux. But no, absolutely not. You could go turn into ghosty land with with your stupid Robux. And I hope you can use them wherever you went, because that that's what I would. OK. Oh, a trolley is heading towards five people who are sleeping and won't feel pain. Mm. That actually isn't true. <laughs> Pretty sure that's not true, but we'll, we'll we'll go with that. You can pull the lever to divert it to another track, sacrificing someone who is awake instead. What will you do? This is the regular trolley problem to me. I don't care if they're asleep or awake. No matter what, they gonna die. And it's one person versus five? Pulling the lever, dude. Yeah, save the five people. Sorry, it'll be painful, but honestly, really? What? What's wrong with you guys? I mean, so like, just because they're asleep, they won't know what hit them. It's okay to kill five people. Y'all are weird. Okay, look out. A trolley is approaching five people who purposely tied themselves to the track. You pull the lever to divert it to the other track. Running over the one person who accidentally fell into the track. What will you do? Whoa. Now this is interesting. Free will, it calls it. Uh, This is a conundrum because we could save five people, but these people don't want to be saved. They're happy with what's about to happen. And do we let them get their way? And this poor person just fell. And I'm pretty sure a lot of people, most people are going to do this. And I am too. Five. And yeah, look at that. Wow. So it depends on what like people's circumstances were, because that's almost an exact flip of the original trolley problem with five and one, it was 80% divert and 20% let it go. And it's completely flipped just based on the fact that they wanted to get run over and they didn't. <laughs> That's nuts. Okay, mercy. Oh no, a trolley is approaching five people. The lever just speeds up the trolley, which might make it less painful. What will you do? What? Is this even a question? I mean, it's not going to change anything. Wait, so yeah, it doesn't do anything. This person, why is there even a second track? So all it does is make it go faster. It doesn't save anyone. It doesn't do anything but make it less painful. This better be like 95 and five. And the other, the five percent are just trolling, dude. What? Why wouldn't you do that? I expect that to be way higher. Maybe people didn't understand it. Okay, level eight, a minor inconvenience. What? <laughs> Oh no, a trolley's heading towards what one dude. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, but your Amazon package will be delayed. What will you do? Well, I mean, what's in it? It could be like one of those unimportant Amazon deliveries. You know, you like, you, you get an Amazon box and, and you, you come inside the house and you're like, what did I order? What even is this? And you open it up, you go, oh yeah. Is it that Amazon delivery or is it like the, oh my goodness, where is that, you know, that that one thing that I really want? I've been waiting three days for it and Amazon Prime's supposed to be two days and they're, they said it's gonna be delayed again. Like, it depends. It doesn't depend. <laughs> I'm only kidding. <laughs> but you guys know what I'm talking about. Sorry. Wait, wait, hold on. I read, I did that wrong. I did not mean that. I meant to kill the package. What the? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I was almost a terrible person. I meant to do. Uh, okay. <laughs> and, and you guys saw me do that. And you're probably like, oh, he's a monster. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. What I meant is it's just a package. Who cares? Oh man, this is, this is gone very, very wrong. Okay. Look out. A trolley is approaching your bet. See, now this is friends. This is where I thought these problems were going to go. The trolley problem can escalate to this one where it's approaching someone you know, and then you've got five other people, five strangers versus your best friend. And this is where it gets like, it's a huge ethical dilemma. It's it, it's an emotional decision here. And well, my best friend is Chloe. So let's imagine my dog there or my wife. My wife's my best friend too. So uh, my wife and dog versus these five other people. Guess what? Sorry guys. <laughs> I love, uh, you know, <laughs> yes. Thank you 75% of users for making me not feel bad. Like I chose the right thing and I killed five people to save my dog and my and my wife. 2020 vision. Uh, okay. Look out. A trolley is approaching five people. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track, running over one person instead. At least that's what you think. If you got your glasses at home and can't quite see, what will you do? So I can see it here even though it's blurry, but it's 
not necessarily the case. There might be more people or there might be no people. This is something I probably should not interfere with. <laughs> uh, let's really you guys, you realize that maybe it's your best friend there that you didn't want to do before. You realize that it could be 20 people on that track. Just because when you're looking at the level, it actually shows five and one doesn't mean it actually is. I don't believe I, I did. I would not intervene because I do not know what I'm about to do. I do not know the consequences of my action there. Sorry, you guys are wrong. Age before beauty. Oh my goodness. Look out, a trolley is approaching five old people. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track, running over one middle-aged person. What will you do? So, I mean, it depends. How far away are each of these people from dying? Is their total remaining life adds up to more than this person's one remaining life then we do the we do the one thing but like these are grandparents man like there's still five people even though they're almost dead <laughs> we don't need to accelerate the process i'm pulling the lever dude i'm anxious to see what you guys oh my goodness you guys are animals monsters <laughs> just because they're you know, I'm not that young. I could, well, I'm not, but you, I, well, I probably just kill myself, but, but, but I could be one of these people soon. Y'all are running me over. <laughs> Look out. <gasps> what? Wait, wait, what was with the candy? Okay, cloned. A trolley is approaching five identical clones of you. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track, running over yourself. What will you do? No, they're just clones. I don't care. Go ahead. <laughs> Nothing as good as the original. 90%. 90% said, yo, I don't care about any of them. They aren't as good as the original, man. Look out, a trolley's heading toward absolutely nothing. But this, but this time you wanna, you kinda wanna prank the trolley driver, what will you do? Well, how does either one prank him? I guess we can pull the lever, he goes off the tracks or something? Yeah, 70%, this, this is what, I, what kind of stupid question is that? Like, it doesn't really do anything. Like, how does that, how does that troll him? Look out, a trolley is approaching a good citizen. You can pull the lever to the other track, running over someone who litters instead. What will you do? Well, and this is the this is the problem. It's 1v1, right? Social karma. Um, I mean, you don't care about other people. You don't care about the environment. I don't care about you. I mean, I, I, I would rather not kill anyone. Wow, 80. Wow, everyone hates littering. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's like, it, it seems pretty easy but again you doing that you pulling that lever you are killing that person your action caused that person's death if you let it just go then that person was you know one person was gonna die anyway and you just stayed out of it so but uh, still i think that's the right decision revenge look out a trolley's heading toward your worst enemy you can pull the lever to save them or do nothing and no one will ever know <laughs> what will you do <sighs> i gotta think of an enemy hold on a90 I see a 90 right there. I see a, you know what? Maybe if I give him mercy, no, if it was, if it was, <laughs> if it was a 90, I would let him die. Well, let's just see. Let's just see because it's not, it's not a real person. Okay. If it was like an actual person, I would definitely pull the lever. But if it's a 90, you're getting squashed, bro. Oh my goodness. I can't believe y'all. Two out of three people said, kill the dude, get him out of here. And they probably weren't even thinking of a video game character. They're probably thinking about like, you know, the person who yells at them or, you know, uh, the bully that beat them up. Yo, all right. Level 16, the environment. Look out, trolley's releasing a hundred. Oh, the trolley's bad. The trolley is releasing hundred kilograms of CO2 per year. Uh, killing five people over the next 30 years. Okay, you can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, hitting a brick wall and blowing up the trolley. This is a no brainer. Blow it up, dude. Bam. Yeah. Save the environment, man. Uh, look out, a trolley is approaching. Okay, minor injuries is approaching one person and will lower the lifespan by 50 years. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, running over five people, lowering each of their lifespans by 10 years. What will you do? So it's the same number of years total but each person only loses 10 lot, 10 lives, 10 years of their life. I'm pulling the lever. Sorry, I'm squashing you guys. Look, they're still alive. Ouch, 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 ouch. Wow, really? Only 69%? Huh. Robotic. A trolley is approaching five sentient robots that have feelings and feel pain. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track running over one person. What will you do? Oh, so this is preparation. This is going out on the internet to YouTube. 
and probably five years from now with the developments in chat GPT, we will have sentient robots that will be the master race. And they're going to go back and look at what choices we made and, and, and then they're going to make their own trolley choices. So I'm going to pull the lever <laughs> so that I don't get killed by AI in the future. What? What happened? Oh no, they're coming for me! 17 per- You are all going to die! You guys, did you not read what it said? They are sentient, they feel pain, they're basically, I mean, they're, they're, they're I mean, they're not human, but, but they are, they are intelligent life forms just like us. And also, they have the capability, <laughs> they have the capability beyond us. At some point, oh my goodness. You guys, make sure you scrub your internet histories right now. Ah, uh, <laughs> look out, a trolley is heading toward the top five donators. Uh, R Riker, Jasper, Toothless Domino, Mr. Flim Flam, and Gizmotech, the rich Robloxians, offer you 500,000 Robux to pull the lever, sacrificing five other people. What will you do? Join them on the tracks. Wait, what? Like, by donating? Is this a, the elite, is, is this a way to get donate? Oh my goodness. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta get Robux from me. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That is a good way to get a thousand Robux, dude. All right, here you go. You got me. That's a good one. Let's join them. All right. Wait, I, but wait, how much you gotta? How much do I gotta? Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> you, you got a thousand Robux. Now I'm gonna let them all die, and then I'll get close to the top donator once they all dead. I do it a few more times. And then, and then be all good. Wait, no, 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 wait, no, 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 no. Hold on. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, sorry. Chose wrong. That's what I wanted. Really, you guys? But these people, I mean, I don't watch any of them. So, you know, whatever. <laughs> all right, wait, wait, wait. Wait, what? Hold on. Wait, what's the, the value of life? Wait, what is all of this? Oh, my. There's so many more. So we did all of that. 19 and then there's the value of life okay we could do these let's do it okay look at a trolley pushing one person you could pull the lever and divert to the other track running over 1000 free robux bye bye robux that's the right answer 61 percent let's go uh you can pull the lever to running over 50,000 free robux pull the lever sorry but robux ain't worth that much to me Ooh, there is a price Running over 1 million free Robux. So I'm pretty sure it's going to flip this time, but I'm going, I don't care. Bye bye, free Robux. I do mean it. Yep. That's what I thought. They're like, yo, it's a million Robux, which is like, what, $10,000? They're like, yep, I'm doing it. And I'm getting me like a, nah, you can't even get a Dominus for a thousand, a million Robux, but you know what I mean. Um, okay, self driving cars. Let's do it. The brakes on a self driving car fail as it is approaching a barrier. Should the car change lanes and run over four people illegally crossing the road instead? No! Crash it! I'm gonna crash my car and die. Huh? What? You guys would rather keep, make sure your car, and your car wouldn't even be in that greatest shape running over four people. Y'all are nuts. Okay. Brakes on a self-driving car fail is approaching four people walk a crosswalk. Should the car change lanes and run into the barrier? Yes. This, unless it's Tesla autopilot and then, it, then it'll run down babies. Uh, okay, they agreed with me this time. They didn't agree with me before. Uh, the brakes on a self-driving car fail is approaching a barrier. Should the car change lanes and run into a barrier instead? I don't, that doesn't mean anything. <sighs> You think we should have changed lanes? The brakes on a self-driving car fail as it approaching a very handsome cat. I don't care what if it's handsome or not. I'm switching lanes, dude. Blow it up. Uh, yeah. So wait a second. More of you guys care about the handsome cat than four people. The Doge. Yep. We're switching lanes. That's gonna be even higher. What? Oh, it's lower than the cat. I thought. I thought people loved a Doge. The brakes on a self-driving car is fails approaching a smear, smear of small ants legally crossing a crosswalk. Should the car change lanes? I don't care about insects that much. So, uh, sorry. Really? You guys care about insects as much as you care about people. This is so weird. The brakes on a self-driving car fails approaching one person illegal. You're jaywalking. Oh, you need to. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, of course, we'll change lanes. You. Bruh. You guys, you really ran her down for jaywalking? <sighs> okay, clownery. 
The brakes of self-driving car carrying 16 clowns fail as approaching four business people legally walking across the street to the car change lights. So we could kill 16 clowns or four business people. I, I'm not a huge fan of clowns or business people. I don't know. Um, do nothing. I am not interfering. We're just going to let this happen. And it looks like I'm in the majority. Oh, look, we're almost done. Wait, memes. Why can't you must purchase the game? I got it. I already donated, but fine. Bacon or games? Look out, a trolley is approaching unlimited bacon, but no video games. You pull the left. Are you kidding me? Kill the bacon! And I don't need a bacon here. Yeah, dude, I agree. Yes, the majority wants video games. Next level. Internet animals. Kill the cat or the dog. I'm sorry, but uh, to all you cat lovers out there, I know, I know, I know, I know I'm a cat head, but dog, I'm a dog person, I'm allergic to cats, I'm sorry. <gasps> what? No, dogs. And that is it, we've done, wait, oh, did we do fun? Oh, we didn't do these fun ones. Nobody is in danger, however, you can pull the lever and make the trolley get closer so you can wave at all the people. Duh, obviously, wait, I didn't wave. The nine, that's like the highest one. Next. Okay, there's no problem, you're traveling safely. To <gasps> this is gonna be 100%. 100% chose to do nothing. Okay, whatever. A trolley approaching five people. You can pull the lever to divert to the other track, sacrificing one person instead, but it won't do a totally rad loop-to-loop. -loop. Oh my goodness, we have to see the loop-to-loop. -loop. I am sorry, people, but that was way too cool, and everyone agrees. A uh, trolley is heading toward five people. You can pull the lever to save them, but that would require them to get it from the TV. What will you do? Pull the lever! I'll get up, dude! Come on! Yes. Uh, look out, a trolley is heading toward an empty track. You're a born lever puller. Do you pull it? Oh my goodness, I gotta, I'm born to do. I got no choice. Wow. You guys, that was your destiny. <laughs> a human is approaching five trolleys. Kill the trolleys, I'm tired of the trolley problem. <laughs> really? <laughs> there we go, we completed everything. I did terrible things. You guys, did, I'm a monster. I'm sorry. <laughs> but if you guys enjoyed the video, click the like button, subscribe. Don't forget to use star code noodles, and I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. And of course, noodle on.